Hey guys, what's going on? It's Josh here with Take'em TV, and uh, today, just out here doing a little bit of deer hunting. Um, I think this is my sixth or seventh sit of the year. So far, we haven't been able to bag anything yet, but today I wanted to come here and uh, just talk to you guys on uh, why I choose to saddle hunt. Overall, um, I think saddle hunting here in the last oh, year, year and a half, maybe two years or so, uh, it's kind of, you know, taken over the hunting industry, especially everybody who hunts public land, like myself. I mean, just the ease of it and everything. So that's going to go ahead, bring me to tip, or not even tip, just like perk number one, you know, like it's the mobility of it. I packed in all of my stuff. I know that they just cut this cornfield yesterday. Um, and I was up in a tree after walking back here within 20 minutes, like all set up, ready to go. And now I'm doing an all day sit on this cornfield. So mobility, I mean, just the, uh, the sheer ease of it and everything is honestly mind blowing. It's lightweight, you can get in, get out, and uh, you can go anywhere you want. You're not limited to, you know, where you can put a hang on or where you can put a ladder stand. You can get in some tight pockets and uh, you can get back in some thick, thick stuff and hang your saddle and, uh, and hunt. And oftentimes that's, you know, where a lot of these bigger deer like to go and uh, it's where you have to go sometimes. So taking a hang on or taking a ladder stand, sometimes it just doesn't work. So you gotta go ahead, switch up and get to a saddle. All right, so reason number two on why I love the saddle is it's honestly very, very comfortable. Like I've, I'm gonna sit here for nine hours today and this is what I'm gonna look like, you know? I'm just leaning. I got a little back strap if I need it, but I haven't needed that yet this year. And I probably have 30 hours already in the stand this year. So I find it a lot more comfortable than like your traditional, you know, ladder stand or something. I always find myself needing to stand up and stretch after sitting there for a long time. So that's gonna be, you know, reason number two why I love my saddle. All right, so reason number three why I love my saddle is the cost. I don't, I don't know if you guys have, you know, a whole bunch of money or, or anything, but like I personally don't have thousands of dollars a year to go and span, spend on hang-ons and ladder stands and everything. So, yes, to get into saddle hunting, you know, initially is, you know, it's, it's a little expensive. I'll, I'll agree with people on that. However, if you go and you buy, like, two XOP um, hang-ons or you buy, you know, three or four ladder stands, like, it that gets really, really expensive. And I would much rather just, you know, buy all my saddle hunting stuff one time, take it anywhere I want to go set it up and tear it down same day super fast super easy and I don't have to worry about you know my stands getting stolen or people hunting out of my stands and you know worrying if somebody's going to be in there or not so I think ultimately uh, that's why a lot of people are switching to saddles as well just because the uh, the overall cost of saddle hunting is a little bit cheaper than you know buying all these stands every year getting new ones hanging them leaving them up there locking them to a tree you know like you're you're constantly worried about people taking them and uh people being in your stands and everything and it's just it's not cool so i think that's a big reason on why people are switching to saddles and honestly 
is the main reason why I switched. I hated my hang-ons. I thought they were a pain to put up. And uh, I hated leaving them up there all year long. I didn't know if they were going to be there when I got there the, the next time. And unfortunately, that's just, you know, the way things go nowadays. People are super greedy. People want your things. And so might as well switch to something that you take in and out with you. And they don't have an opportunity to steal. Okay, so reason number four on why I love my saddle is I feel like it's just less bulk in the tree. Like with a with a hang on, um, I feel like that you know they're big, they're bulky. You stick out a lot more. You have to trim more trees, and uh, I just feel like you stick out more to the deer, especially with a ladder stand. Like those things are crazy. But like a saddle, I just, I climbed this tree on some public land. I don't have, you know, the, the best shooting lanes in the world, but like I got one, two, three, four, and you know, five on this side, but I'm making it work. Like it's a, it's a custom thing, you know? So I just feel like you can hide yourself better. You can hide behind the tree. You can kind of get yourself situated and then you can, like use that tree to hide behind and kind of pivot your way around to get a shot off on a deer. It's it's a lot sneakier in my opinion and you're just not this big blob 20 feet up on the side of a tree trying to shoot this deer. It's just something that I've always struggled with especially like with hang-ons. I felt like I was always trimming trees extremely heavy Especially when it came to my ladder stands. I I hated putting those up. I hated trimming the trees. I just felt like I was sticking out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, so reason number five, and honestly, it's probably the biggest reason in my opinion, um, is just the overall weight of my saddle hunting setup. I, I love it. It's super lightweight. Like, today, I'm... Two and a half miles back on some public land like yeah there's there's roads that i can you know walk back here and there's horse trails to get back here and whatever but like carrying my old hang on stand back here would have sucked it would have not been fun and i understand there's you know there's new hang-ons out there that weigh four or five pounds and there's systems to go with it and everything to make it easier to get for you to carry it in but like I just have a XOP Striker Evolution backpack. All of my saddle stuff just you know clips right into that. Sticks go on the bottom, platform goes on the, the back side, and then I carry my bow arm in there. I carry my camera arm, my camera, a puffy coat and some snacks and a drink. Like that's all I need. And I can go forever with it. Like I can walk all day long. I can find the perfect spot that I want to be in, not be tired. And that that's huge to me. I, I love walking around the public land. I love exploring it all. I love getting out here and finding new spots. And for me to be able to be mobile like that because of you know, hunting out of the saddle, it, uh, it's honestly kind of changed the whole, or my whole perspective on deer hunting, and I absolutely love it, so, if you guys haven't ever tried saddle hunting, I would highly encourage it, you know, you don't, you don't have to go and buy the most expensive setups, like, I run Skeletor Sticks, I run a Trophy Ridge Mission Platform and a Hawk Saddle. So like overall, it's not the most expensive setup that I could ever have, but I do, I love it. Um, you know, here in the near future, will I switch up some stuff? Like, yeah, probably as, as new companies or as companies come out with new products and everything. But like overall, this is a game changer of a hunting system and I I wouldn't trade it for anything I love it it's awesome 
the ease of it is insane. Um, but if you guys want to see like a, an overall uh, video on my, my saddle hunting setup, go down, check it out in my channel. It's like the most viewed video on my channel at like 33,000 views or something. I know I'm, I'm super glad everybody loved my, my saddle hunting setup, but the biggest thing is like making sure that you guys, you yourself are comfortable and you guys feel safe in what you're doing. But I would highly recommend anybody who wants to try out saddle hunting to give it a try. I mean, just the, the overall positives of saddle hunting completely outweigh the negatives on it like crazy. And I think that's why it's, it's getting so popular, honestly, in, in my opinion. So with that being said, um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I, I understand it, it was a really short one and it was kind of like a spontaneous video. However, you know, just out here, hanging in a tree and uh, I, I thought you guys would appreciate it. So with that being said, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And I'll see you guys in the next